Hey there viewers and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank 3. Now before we go to the Hollow Star Studios, I kind of want to do something really quick. Uh, for those of you who might have noticed during the last set of videos, I have amassed a fair amount of skill points off screen. So for those of you who are wondering, or are wondering now that I've mentioned it, no, I do not plan on getting all of the skill points in the game. The only reason I went after these was because I needed to have exactly 15 to unlock a certain something. No, not the Lombax orange paint job on the ship, but a certain cheat code. Now, I know I normally say I don't like cheat codes, but that's advantageous cheat codes like the Rich Replacement thing, which, like some people said, would have made the wrench-only boss fight against Scorpio a lot easier. But again, I don't like advantageous cheats. So, what I was wanting to activate was the Secret Agent Clank alternate skin, which isn't really a cheat, it's more or less just an alternate skin, just like the ones you buy with the Titanium Bolt. So, we have the Ratchet Tuxedo, and we have the Clank Tuxedo matching set. But now we can go off to the Hollow Star Studios. And as for the skill points, if I get them, that's fine, but I'm not going to go out of my way to get them. Jeeves, activate the cloaking device. With pleasure, sir. Now you see us, now you... Oh, crud. Cut! Cut! That's it! You've disgraced my set for the last time, kid. Take up basket weaving. You're fired! Get me the monkey. I'll see you at the trailer, Clank. Agent Clank, meet your new sidekick. All right, forget the chase scene and go right to the grand finale. You did read the script I sent you. Uh... Eh, uh, first you narrowly survive a series of death-defying stunts, yada yada. You defeat the terror of Talos, yada yada yada. Finally, you rescue the Baroness, played by the lovely Miss Courtney Gears. Okay... And... action! All right, this is the part where you take out the henchmen, then chase Maximilian out of the bar. Try to make it look real, all right? Action! Wait, Maximilian? Oh, please don't be a Pegasus, because I don't believe in the heart of the cards, and I don't feel like being sent to the Shadow Realm. Oh, you got the stuff, kid. Now get to Maximilian's office before he can make his escape. And you thought Russell Brand was crazy on set. You haven't seen nothing yet, Mr. Director. So let us be a reminder to you and everyone else on set, especially you, Catering Services. When I order for blueberry muffins, I mean blueberry, not banana bran. Next time, I burn down this entire set. Okay, Clank is hot on his tail. Max Million tries to shake him off in rush hour traffic. All right, I love a good chase scene. A chase scene in which no one's actually being chased, okay? But you know, I really enjoyed the outfit that Ratchet was wearing. All right, you're doing great, kid. Now, avoid the lasers and meet up with the monkey in the casino parking lot. Okay, that's actually death. Cut! Cut! This is what I get for letting him do his own stunts. One more time, people, like we rehearsed it. And action! Take two. But yeah, I always wanted to see if I could play some crafts at that crafts table. The stuff, kid. Now get to Max Million's office before he can make his escape. Whoops. Hey, okay, Clank is hot on his tail. Max Million tries to shake him off in rush hour traffic. All right, I love a good chase scene. But like I was trying to say. All right, you're doing great, kid. Now avoid the lasers and meet up with the monkey in the casino parking lot. This is why I hate movie directors. They don't shut up. What I was trying to say was that Ratchet looked more like a bellhop or one of those movie theater bouncers than a chauffeur, but at the same time, it kind of worked for him. Whoops. I need to get him up. Oh, actually, these are enemies. For a second, I thought they were my... my for a second, I thought they were my little minions that I haven't seen since going commando. Such a shame. I miss those guys. In this scene, Agent Clank and the monkey must put aside their differences and work together to reach that land. How'd you get up there? Let's see some real emotion. Come on, you're a monkey. You should know how to jump. Now... Can I actually abuse this and get up there myself? No, damn it. Okay, then how am I... No, you stupid monkey! Oh. Or we could just do this. Outwitted by a monkey. I didn't know there was another button up here. That makes things a lot easier. <gasps> There's my minions! My little guys are back! I love you guys! I've missed you so much! Yay! The bridge is out! 
think fast. How would Agent Clank get across? He'd abuse his monkey, of course. So how have you guys been? The family's doing well, I hope. Did your little boy ever make the football team? And that's actually gonna kill him. Oof. They were so young, too. Died before they had a chance at life. Such a shame, but I guess I can take solace in the fact that their offsprings are continuing daddy's work. Only, really, only four hours? That means that the hammer guy and the, uh, the bridge guy's not gonna be in this game. Oh, damn. I actually like those guys from Going Commando. No. So back to just simplistic attack, enter. Fantastic. Keep it up, Clank. What was the other one? No, can't do it right now. Gee, I think it's attack, defend, enter, and wait. Ooh. I like having more options. I love it. Okay, this is it, people. The grand finale, Giant Clank versus the Terror of Talos. Don't screw this up, kid. Action! So wait, we didn't need to enter some sort of platform to have Super Clank mode? We just automatically are in it. Does that mean that Clank can know, or doesn't have to have one of those platforms any longer? Does that mean that Clank is now capable of entering Super Clank mode all on his own? Probably not. Let's see, giant robots, gratuitous explosions, nonsensical storyline. Oh my god, we're in a Michael Bay film! Giant, oh, giant ninjas, now we are definitely in a Michael Bay film. Don't even need to question it any longer. They did really improve the giant super clink battles, though. I mean, in Going Commando, I just did not enjoy that at all. Every time the... I mean, the little helicopters and everything else just seem to be a little bit too powerful in that game. But now I'm just destroying them like crazy. Although I do need to find some more mini ninjas. Mini ninjas. Giant ninjas. Wrong game. No! Damn it, do not blow up the nuclear fusion plant. We're gonna end up growing another head. Okay, there's one more ninja somewhere. If I can find him. Where is he at? Apparently he really is a ninja. He's hiding where I can't find him. Hiding in the shadows. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Ah, there he goes. And of course, six more spawn. But if I can take out these tanks, hopefully they don't have a spawn point. Hopefully there's no military base around here. Okay, watch out for the oil tanks. I think those are doing more damage to me than the helicopters and ninjas. Can I blow them up from afar? Yes, I can. Hell yeah. You know, I don't even need to use my bombs and my rockets, really. My fists seem to be doing enough damage as it is. Get over here! Hit him with the Kung Fu, Clank. Yeah, I don't think Clank knows any Kung Fu. He's an agent. No, I, I guess spies know Kung Fu. Technically. That's it, Clank. Kill him! Ah! Thank God I do not wear headphones when I record, because that right there would have split my ears. And I'm guessing he's not really that experienced as being a producer if he's messing up with the Blowhorn that badly. Blowhorn? No, not Blowhorn. Megaphone. Blowhorn is the name of his next movie. And you know what? Come to think of it, I don't even think the guy's a real director because he didn't have a beret, did he? You can't be a director unless you have a beret. Which can only mean he's fronting for someone else and I really need to call this guy one thing. I keep calling him producer, director, whatever else. I'm actually taking a lot more damage than I thought I was. Holy crap. It's a helicopter. It's gotta be. You! Die! And here I was talking about how they're not doing that much damage to me, and I'm near dead. No, stay away from the tank. Tanker. Oil tanker. Whatever. Where'd he go? And there's still one more ninja somewhere. There he is. Get him, quick. Please, no more spawn. 
Good, that was the last of them. Now for him, if I don't die. And I'm starting to think that maybe I didn't need to kill those ninjas either. I could have just gone straight after the boss. I'm gonna die. Crap. One more time, people, like we rehearsed it, and action! You know, this time I think I'm just gonna ignore the ninjas altogether and see if I can kill them that way. Because it's not like he was only coming down when there were no ninjas on the field. He was coming down whenever he wanted to. Alright, well I messed it up, but I think the idea for this boss fight is to make sure there's only one ninja left when you go after the big lizard. That way they can't all swarm you. And it's a wrap. Take five, people. Clank smash! All in a day's work. Cut! Print it! That's a wrap, people! Pure box office raritanium clank. Even the critics are gonna love it. You have no idea what a thrill it is to be rescued by a big hunk of titanium alloy like yourself. <laughs> Perhaps now you will tell me what Dr. Nefarious is planning. I have a better idea. Why don't you ask him yourself? I have a present for you, Snooky Wookums. Ah! I told you to stop calling me that! Just bring me Agent Clank! Of course, darling. Where am I? Is someone there? I seem to... Agent Clank, it is an honor to finally make your acquaintance. I have been following your exploits ever since your first mission, when you defeated the mind-stealing snot beasts from Dimension X. I believe there has been a misunderstanding. Secret Agent Clang is merely a fictional character I play on the horror video. Lies! Squishy lies! Oh, Lance, I can't. It's not right. You're my cousin's uncle's son. Lies! You are a hero to robots across the galaxy, and yet, you deny your own destiny! You choose to bow and scrape before the squishies! Where is your pride in who you are, Agent Clank? Organic life forms have as much right to inhabit this galaxy as we do. I see no reason to exclude them. I will give you a reason. Join me, and together we will rule an entire galaxy of robots. Or refuse. Remain a traitor to your own kind and follow your beloved squishies into the black hole of oblivion! <laughs> the fairies isn't a bad guy, he's just misunderstood. He can't separate fiction from reality. Clank should have been back by now. What could be taking him so long? Ah! ah. What ah? Oh, that ah! Wait, since when did he get a jetpack? I swear, by the end of this game, everyone's gonna be flying. Let's see, what have I not leveled up? Ma oh, let's do the Agents of Doom. I need to get these in level 4. Level up my minions! Not quite Clank's minions, but my minions! We each have our own slaves to command. No, do not run into the boxes. See, that's why I hate the suicide boots. There's no way to stop them. Now, can we actually enter... No, we can't enter Clank's place. Such a shame. Well, then let's destroy it. Unless there's an alternate way in there. Back door? Or there's something up there. A ledge we can reach? No. Okay. 